Yep. Uh, here's another song from the uh, the new recording. We're into that part right now. This is a song that Mike uh, Rogers and his his co-writing buddy, one of them, uh, Tom Botkin, wrote yeah. this year. And, and uh, man, it, it took me back to to, uh, to days when there were less worries. And, and uh, you know, I remember the old general stores. There's not many of them left around, but uh, where you could go get whatever you wanted to. Uh, they stopped everything. If you want to go ahead and get it over with, you could get uh, go down and buy the measles for your kids and go ahead and one day hand it on. <laughs> I'm just kidding. About that part anyway. But I know that you'll really, really enjoy it. Some of you folks maybe can relate to it and some of you all might want to pay attention because uh, it was a good time and we just didn't realize it's a good time. You ready? Well, this song makes me hungry. Well, it does me too. I get it. <laughs> Good, the salty country ham. It's the only thing we left out was soda crackers. Soda crackers, yeah. It's important. All right. Swifty, let's do what I call the country store. All right. But the hound dog by the door is still sleeping. Old man staring, you walk in. And behind the counter stands Big Jim. He's five feet tall and a little change. Telling stories with a grin on his face. It smells like country ham and cheese. There's a pot belly stone with checkers by the door. It's a dying breed, the old country store. Fishing lures, guns, and knives. Camo gear and turkey calls. The heart goes in overalls. It's a whole lot different than the new quick sight. Cause when you leave, they say, y'all come back. It smells like country ham and cheese. Pop the back of the It's a dying breed, the old country store. If you're ever around these bars, stop in. Cause if you do, you're gonna wanna come back again. There's a radio station playing country. Hey, give me shit. 